Listen to this beautiful Bible quote from 2 Corinthians 9 verse 8. And God is able to provide you with every blessing in abundance so that by always having enough of everything, you may share abundantly in every good work. How often do we find ourselves looking forward to a paycheck? I have many times, so have you. As if that paycheck was our very source of our prosperity. Yes, our incomes are important, and we, we give thanks for them. But our paychecks and our places of employment are simply outlets for our blessings. Our source is God. God is the source of blessings that come through many different channels. So whether we define prosperity as more money, healthy relationships, or even peace of mind, let's give thanks to God as the originator of it all. Then we are always open to new and creative ways that our blessings can come to us. We know that God is the source of all blessings and we are abundantly blessed. My dear friend, the poet James Dillett Freeman, wrote, Make me a blessing, Lord. Because blessings just don't come to us. We're not like a catcher catching the good of God and then holding on to the ball of blessing. No, we have to give it away and become full circle. He says, Make me a blessing, Lord. Help me. To help those needing help. To be a blessing to my fellow humans. Instruct me when to speak and when to hold my speech. When to be bold in giving, and when to withhold. And if I have not enough strength, then give me strength, Lord. Make me tough with my own self, but tender toward all others. Let there be outpoured on me the gentleness to bless all who have need of gentleness. Give me a word, a touch to fill, a lonely life, faith for the ill, and courage to keep hearts up through. My own is feeling just as low. And when men have bitter things to meet, and quail would accept defeat, then Let me lift their eyes to see the vision of thy victory. Help me to help. Help me to give the wisdom and will to live. I pray today that you have endless God blessing in your life. In Jesus Christ's name, amen.